All right, let's go ahead and get the jumpers out of the way. USB 3 jumpers and a remaining fan cable for the front fan. So USB cables and audio. Get all that out of the way now. That's pretty straightforward. So they have a nice little spot for it. And go ahead and push all those through here. These are basically all the front panel connections. USB 3, USB, the audio ports, power switch, reset button, all those things. And there they are. So let's start simple. Let's start with regular old USBs. Here's one. You can only plug those in one way, so you can't really screw it up. Here's another old USB. I'm going to feed the slack through as I plug them in. Make it easier for later. All right, there's those two. We have our HD audio, which is always off to the side here. Like I said, that's going to control the microphone and headphone jacks on the front of the computer. See, look at that. Nice and tight. That looks good. USB 3 we can do next, but I want to get our jumpers on the other side of that. Okay. So USB 3, I think I'm actually going to leave the slack for that in this case, but we'll see. Because these connectors like to come out. If you put too much stress on it, it's just going to give you problems. Yeah, I think we're going to leave it like that. Then we have our jumpers. And they're actually labeled on the, on the motherboard itself. So you can just go off of that, plus and negative. And the, the jumpers will actually say that. So power LED is first, plus and negative. some more light on here. And what do we have next? We have reset switch. Now we'll do the hard drive LED first because it's right next to it. Just makes it easier to plug the other ones in just because you have the two in place you need. So reset switch doesn't matter how you put that one on. It basically just creates a short and causes the motherboard to reset itself. And there's the power switch and that goes right above the reset switch and the positive one is the one that has an arrow on it I believe I don't think it really matters though to be honest all right there's our jumpers I'm gonna go ahead and pull the slack for those through these I like to be nice and tight yeah look at that beautiful Okay. <laughs> now we're going to need a uh Here's our front fan connector. That's going to be our bottom system fan too. So I think we can go this route with it. Go through the same one as the jumpers and everything else. Actually, you know what? No, let's go the other route. I like this route because then we can hide that four pin connector right behind it. All right, we have our front fan plugged in. Well, here's our top fan, which is over here. 
go ahead and plug that in while we're at it. All right, boom, we have all our fans plugged in.